opportunities in women's sport, I think, are almost endless, and it goes across a variety of different uh, sectors, whether it's from just playing in a local club um, situation all the way through to elite sport, whether it's um, females in the media, females in administration, coaching. And it was a watershed moment. It was only, you know, very recent that we had a had a spate of time where Australians were doing so well on the field, on the court, which I think they've always done, but it was just the fact that it was in just a small um, pocket of time and everyone just sort of sat up and, and took notice. It was Michelle Payne winning the, the Melbourne Cup. It was the first ever Bathurst female all-driving team. There's all these things as Southern Stars won the Ashes back on England soil. It was absolutely fantastic. Um, so all of a sudden, all the eyes of you know Australian people who love their sport, but even people who don't love sport, were suddenly saying there seems to be this movement going on in and around this space. You know, what, what's going on? How good is it? So we've got this one moment in time, I think, that we can really capitalise on, on this. And for me, a lot of that is going to be about an opportunity of everyone getting on the same page. Um, we don't want to miss this opportunity. We don't want to look back in 30 years' time and say, if only. And I think a lot of the if only will be negated if we can get everyone that's involved uh, in this space, in the same room, and, and really sharing all their, their experiences to date so that we can look ahead to a vision of you know, Australian sport for, for women and girls in 30 years' time and go, yeah, we nailed it. We didn't, we didn't let a moment slip by.